to foo by sleeping with a married woman. Yeah this was actually last week. I don't know what to do, I just need this off my chest. It started out as a normal beer with friends, last Friday. We always go to the same pub to start, sometimes stay there all night. It's a cool pub which only plays heavy rock slash metal. If you're sick of chart music or pop it's a great spot to hang out and play pool. We got there, I paid for a round of drinks for us and we started out the night smashing Metallica and Sabbath on the jukebox. The friends I'm with have other friends there who I'm less acquainted with, but I know of their faces and vaguely their names. So as we're drinking and picking songs, a few girls walk over to my pals with the usual hey how you doing etc. The woman I'm talking about is one of these friends, and introduced herself to me. She was nice, tomboyish, quite good looking and I had fun chatting with her. She asked me to put Bruno Mars on in this pub, first red flag. A few more drinks into the night, we get bored of the jukebox and head out to the beer garden to smoke and chat some more. I immediately noticed wherever I sat she would pick the seat next to me, and sort of lean in. She would get really close. I thought okay cool she seems interested in me, maybe this could be a good night. I told her I was staying with my buddy and his girlfriend at their place since my car was already there. She's good friends with my buddy's girlfriend, so she blagged staying over there too and we all got a taxi back together. We got back and continued drinking slash partying together. We were all really drunk and the flirting was less awkward at this point. She was cuddling into me on a sofa whilst we all chatted. At some point, around 3 am, she pulls her phone out and says wonder what the hubby's up to and I was like wait. What? You have a husband? To which she replied yeah for 10 years. This was just a stepping stone in the fuck up. I asked her to come outside and chat about it saying like WTF are we doing? She explained the relationship had been dying for years, they live separately and it's not even a real relationship anymore. I don't know what I thought about this, but I kept the flirting up as this calmed me a little bit about the situation. Eventually we end up in bed together and had sex. It was awful. I don't think we were compatible in that regard but I tried my best nonetheless. I didn't want to be labeled a shit shag or whatever idk. So I wake up the next day pretty early and leave saying thanks for hanging out etc but I gotta get home. I thought okay mistake has been made but we'll just leave it at that. After all, her marriage isn't going well and will inevitably end. And here comes the fuck up. She found and messaged me on Facebook. Something along the lines of, would gladly let you throw me around again xxx, and I clicked on her profile. My fucking heart dropped. I instantly recognized the pictures of her husband. And they looked so happy together. At least online they did. The husband is someone I used to smoke weed with and chill with a lot, through secondhand friends. We had the same dealer and would chill at the dealer's house for a couple. This happened weekly for nearly a year or two, but we never really knew each other past that. All I can say about this dude is he is really a great person and I enjoyed his company. Sometimes he would talk about how his wife is being crazy and distant with him and it made him sad. I fucked up guys. I need to tell him but I don't want to hurt anyone, but it's beyond that now. I followed my cock and this is where it's landed me. FML. DL. Drive. I slept with a woman knowing she has a husband. I thought it was a failing marriage. But turns out I used to hang out with the husband and he's a really great guy. I'd never met the wife before this night. Now I don't know what the fuck to do. The double standards of Reddit is crazy. Everybody saying don't tell the husband the wife is cheating. But the posts about the husband cheating. Everybody says to tell the wife. I'm gonna be honest man. You know this guy you have all the proof that his wife has been messaging you. It sounds like she definitely doesn't want you to tell him and she's telling you a bunch of things. So you won't tell him. But if you really feel bad about it. And you know the guy. Just tell him. Like sure it could go badly. But that's why you do it over text and not in person. Of course you don't have to tell him. 
but his wife is cheating on him and you have solid proof. Sure you don't know anything about their relationship but if it's truly a relationship falling apart. This could help him in a divorce case. It's up to you in the end though man. Good luck. Honestly it's both of your faults. You willingly slept with someone knowing they had an husband and she willingly slept with you. Knowing she was married. Both of you get bonk with horny hammer. Sigh h h h h h h h x d d so many of you need the fucking horny stick. Don't follow the cock lmao the cock lies. Just tell him. He deserves to know that his wife is slutting it up. You're wrong. But she is w a a a a a y y y y y more wrong. She should have ended it with her husband before she decided to whore around. I don't care how shitty she thought, thinks her relationship is with him. She is dead wrong. Minus 38 year old married female. Best of luck blue heart. There were lots of poor decisions made that night. You knew she was married before you decided to sleep with her. Who she was married to should be irrelevant. In the future I would make it a policy to keep your dick out of women you know are married. You can move on from this one night stand of poor decision making. Since there's so many selfish voices telling you otherwise. I'm gonna tell you to give the husband the truth. After the gross thing you did to him. That's the least you can do to feel like your vest is clean again. Sure. You can also be a coward. And live with it for the rest of your life. If they are living apart, they are separated. Only married on paper till the divorce kicks in. First red flag don't come for Bruno. Exclamation mark. Exclamation mark exclamation mark colon opening parenthesis. Some folk are promiscuous, some are lifers. Be a man. Tell the truth. You met a woman. Things progressed. She told you she was separated so you didn't think anything more until you find out it was his wife. Apologize and let the man move on and find a person who isn't a cheating piece of shit. Don't contact her again and definitely don't sleep with her again. If she threatens you in any way. Tell her you know her husband. Tell her you don't plan on telling him unless she won't leave you alone. If you sleep with her again. It's going to become an affair with feelings and drama. That's when things really get fucked up. You had the chance to abort and decided not to. Face this as a lesson learn. Although I think it is not your problem. She needs to respect the other person. You should definitely tell him you're not in the wrong she told you that were separated in all put. Paper and it sounds like she lied. He deserves to know the truth about what's going on no one should have go through a cheating. Relationship. Let him know. It won't be easy but it's the right thing to do. Unpopular opinion coming. It isn't your responsibility for her to be faithful. If it wasn't you. It certainly would have been anyone else. You have no obligation to either party in their marriage. You fucked up. Now stay well clear of the whole situation and people involved. There may be loads of things going on which you don't know about. Him being a cool guy doesn't mean you know their relationship. If they really are separated he might be relieved. Personally I just wouldn't waste energy on it. They are adults. It was her fault if he had no clue. And you have no responsibility to tell anyone anything. It may hang on your head. But if you're worried about ruining whatever their happiness is. Saying something would do that anyway. A teacher a long time ago explained this concept while we were looking at a certain play. People have this feeling of justice that they feel they need to satisfy. But really that feeling is causing bigger drama. Let things lie where they are. And if it really bugs you just avoid the girl. 
as someone who has been cheated on. I knew long before I actually knew. And that nagging feeling can make you feel crazy. If the other person just wrote an email that was a summary of this post saying I met this woman here. This is how we hooked up. This is when I found out she was married. I looked you up. I feel absolutely terrible but thought you should know. It would have been a total relief. It's going to suck. But including so many details that the wronged party can't be gaslit into thinking you're insane or making shit up will go a long way. It'll also help him get a divorce in states where that is tricky without proof of infidelity and can even help him keep custody of his kids in states where dads start at a disadvantage. Also, if she is that casual about telling you she was texting her husband, she has absolutely done this before to the point where she is comfortable doing it semi-openly. That guy needs to get tested ASAP and honestly you probably do too. Confession may be good for the soul but it's a lead pipe enema for a marriage. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.